What's up, Vegas Nation? LeAndre Fox here in the Las Vegas Review Journal studio with your Raiders update. How's it going, everybody? LeAndre Fox here at the Oakland Raiders facility in Alameda, California. The Raiders have just finished up practice for the week. They travel to Los Angeles to take on the Chargers in a Week 10 rematch on Sunday. Now, Raiders head coach John Gruden did announce that rookie running back Josh Jacobs, offensive guard Richie Incognito, and linebacker Markel Lee would all be out for Sunday's contest. How's it going, everybody? Le'Andre Fox here at the Oakland Alameda County Coliseum, where the Raiders, in their final time ever playing in the city of Oakland, have fallen to the Jaguars 20 to 16. How's it going, everybody? Le'Andre Fox here at the Oakland Raiders facility in Alameda, California, where we just watched the final Oakland Raiders regular season practice. It's the final regular season practice because after last week's win over the Chargers, their playoff hopes were revived. And if they're able to handle business in Denver, they have a shot at that last wild card spot. However, they will need a ton of help from the Texans, the Ravens, and the Colts. And they will have to beat the Broncos without running back Josh Jacobs. From Antonio Brown's feet to closing the Coliseum and everything in between, we've watched this Raiders team experience one true roller coaster of a season. Now, they didn't know it at the time. But both Jacksonville and Tennessee had put their postseason hopes to bed way before Shelby Harris batted down their chances at finishing the season 500. And now their time as Oakland Raiders has come to an end. They'll hold OTAs in the Bay, and training camp will still be in Napa. But when they take the field next year, they will officially be known as the Las Vegas Raiders. I'm extremely grateful to be here, uh, dealing with a lot of adversity. Uh, some uh, ups and ups and things, so I'm excited to be back. Yeah. Back to the game at the end. Oh, yeah. So, so far, you know, how has it been going through your first two field season? You know, I know the players are disappointed because they're the ones out there between the lines, and those are the guys that got to go out there and block and tackle and, you know, blood, sweat, and tears. They stopped you know, the game, and it was Took my middle linebacker away for 12 weeks. The end of this season. He stopped the game in Kansas City and took Mullen's interception away. Why the hell don't you stop the game and get the clock right? 